research has shown that unfortunately our clinical judgment alone is not sufficient. We are not super great at being able to tell when clients are off track. Um, and so having that early signal alarm is a really helpful part of measurement-based care. We do see that the bigger effect sizes are like all the way up to that 0.70 is when measurement-based care has a feedback component, particularly when the feedback is given to the patient and the clinicians, when there's clinical support tools, so there's actually decision supports for us as clinicians that we have a sense of what to do next, and measures are actually used to adjust the treatment plan. Meaning that the more often that clinicians viewed their results, the more they improved. So I'm gonna say that again. The more the clinicians viewed the results, the more the patient improved. And what we found in Maryland is that the more number of assessments that were in the system were actually associated with improvements um, because so often we can input these data into a system but never go to query it or look at the graph, right? So this makes sense. The more that you're using it, looking at it, um, then that's where you're really gonna see the good effects of measurement-based care, particularly with children and adolescents.